Carpal Tunnel Syndrome. The clinical picture of Carpal Tunnel Syndrome, usually the patient will complain of pain, numbness, and parathesia in the palmar aspect of the thumb, index, and long finger. It is at the median nerve distribution. Symptoms of carpal tunnel syndrome occur more at night. These symptoms wake the patient up from sleep, causing the patient to shake the hand in an attempt to resolve these symptoms. Positive tenel sign. Percussion of the volar wrist crease produces electric sensation distally to the fingers. Phalen test is usually positive. How phalen test is done? It is done by flexing the wrist for 60 seconds. This will increase the carpal tunnel pressure temporarily and produce the symptoms. If the test is positive, the patient will have numbness and tingling in the hand and the wrist. Positive compression test, darkens test, this is the most sensitive test. The examiner places even pressure with two thumbs directly over the patient's median nerve in the carpal tunnel for about 30 seconds. Reproduction of symptoms in the distribution of the median nerve means that the test is positive for carpal tunnel syndrome. A self-administered hand diagram is extremely helpful. It is the most specific test for carpal tunnel syndrome. The patient should highlight the areas where they are experiencing the symptoms. Patient may complain of thinner atrophy, weakness, or clumsiness of the hand. The patient history and examination is an indication for carpal tunnel syndrome. Carpal tunnel syndrome is a clinical diagnosis. The nerve is much like a truck passing through a tunnel. The nerve should be able to pass through the tunnel with ease and without friction. So if the tunnel is narrow, then the nerve cannot pass. And if you want the nerve to pass, then widen the tunnel. And we widen the tunnel by cutting the transverse carpal ligament, as you see here in this example. 